15 spot in the 32 seat. Brad Slutsky. Brad started at Taylor and Phil. What do you got to do? Well, uh, for starters, I don't really know what to do with my hands right now. I think I can down my sides. Uh, we've been working on the card all week, and we got it rolling today. There's only one way to go. So, keep going to the front. We've got to thank all the trainees and Fred Moore and everybody to help us all week. Good luck, man. Starting at a 14 spot. The number 20 of the game per hour. What are you going to do here, Andy? Well, it's probably going to be a long race, a lot of cautions, and uh, if you want to win here, you got to finish uh, doing this all the best and uh, overcome this. Uh, it's been a tough weekend, and I got a lot of good guys. It's been a lot of great help. We have a great attitude. Hopefully we'll all pay off again and we'll be at the front. All right, have a good luck. Starting at 13th spot, the 16th of Eric Ritchie. You still got a lot of cars? The past two Eric, you've been working on his ass for a while this weekend. But hey, the race, that's all that matters. Yeah, uh, the race, I guess, is a lot about patience. You know, there's bound to be a lot of cautions. We have had a lot of problems, especially earlier. Starting in the 12th spot in the T33, Stephen Fitchfield. Who you got to thank, Stephen, and what you got to do? Uh, I'd like to thank Billy Tweed with Tweed Card Shops, uh, sales, I mean. Uh, my dad, my parents, my grandparents, and everybody else. James Kirby, Kirby Speed Secrets, and Matt Cornell for the tires. And uh, just keep my nose clean. And Stay out of the racks, I guess. All right, well, good luck, Starting in the 11th spot in the time of 7.002 to 47 of Philip Madigan. We'd like to thank Phil. Uh, I'd like to thank Dad, Mom, Todd Crunch all this weekend. He's really helped me out a lot. So hopefully we can just stay out of trouble and work my way up through there. So that's some goals. All right, I'm down to the front, though. Starting in the 10th spot, the number seven of Kyle King. Oh, there you go. Last couple of years, I missed this part of the day. I can't really go. Yeah, I got the coach. JB Courage. Ben Waller, this whole family, the Lifers, and uh, everybody else that helped me out today. I'm a little upset after a super heavy race, but we're just going to try and survive this one. All right, most of these cars are pretty consistent. It's going to take a lot of patience. Starting in the ninth spot with a 6.533, the 68, taking a long haul from New York, Eddie Simmons. Yeah, spun it out in qualifying, so it's got to come from the back. Oh, I've seen you win a lot of races, Eddie, so I know you do good. Yeah, hopefully. First time down here, so I can't complain. Starting in the eighth spot. Two-time defending, actually in double, two years in a row. Wherever this driver may be. You're the man to be, China. T-Tron Hugh, as a two-time defending champion, on the 51 of Sean Nye. Well, I start eighth, so it's going to be tough, you know, to win again, but... The cart's fast, I'm not really sure. There's a lot of, you know, tough, tough carts in there. The 12 cart's pretty fast, it's been fast all day. You know, he starts in the front. Um, so we'll see what, what happens, you know. Anybody want to thank Sean? Um, not really, just the crew. You know, Goof, um, Andrew, it's his cart, and uh, just myself. I mean, I basically do everything myself, so, you know, I'm the only guy to think. <laughs> all right, Sean, good luck. Starting in the seventh spot, a driver I have known very well, the 38 of Cody Sieber. Definitely have your work cut out for you today, Cody. You think you can get it done? Hey, we got a little ways to go there. We've had a pretty up and down whole weekend, really, but uh, you know, we're just trying to keep our nose clean and see what happens. 
Anybody want to thank? Oh, yeah. I want to thank uh, Mark Moe, Trick Olympic, Brandon Mollis, Mollis Speed Concepts, Matt Chavis, uh, JoeCarter.com, uh, everybody back here in the pits. They work their butts off. So I want to thank all them, too. Hammer down and good luck, Cody. Starting in the sixth spot, SCR Heart Shop with a new Demon Sinister Chassis, Kirby Speed Secrets. Had a good qualifying run at a 6.828, Todd Hot Rod Crenshaw. Just like to thank James Kirby, he takes care of us there, and um, Denver Smith built this go-kart for us. It seems to be real well, it's handling good, and hopefully got the right four on it today. All right, Todd, well, good luck, buddy. Thanks. Starting in the fifth spot with a brand new cart, brand new motor, different look for this driver, the 112 of Kale Ross. Just want to take take a minute to thank Ben Terramino with BNT Tools. He's uh, funding the program this weekend. We appreciate that. I uh, thank Brandon Mullis, Mullis Speed Concepts. Definitely put us on the map today. And uh, we'll see what we got here. Good luck, Kale. Starting in the fourth spot with a lap of 6.748. Another driver from New York, multiple winner at Syracuse Indoors. Trying to get it done here at Motorama, Ryan Schwartz. Uh, I'd like to thank Lance Yeager and uh, Travis Orwick at Speed Tech and uh, Chavis Motorsports with awesome power. Uh, Lance and Travis have been taking care of me all day, keeping me up front, just try to stay out of the mess. All right, well, good luck, Ryan. Now one of the top three with a 6.681. A native of New York, currently resides in North Carolina, the 42X of Tim Nye. Well, uh, a couple weeks ago we weren't going to be here after Atlantic City, but I talked the wife into letting me come down. And uh, had been an up and down weekend. Uh, Got to thank uh, Bobby Johnson here and Rick Holt for uh, lending me a motor. Had a few questioning the motor, and I guess now I got no excuses, so see what we can do. So. Also, like to thank Chris Murphy and uh, Goof for helping me out, and my brothers, and hopefully we can put a stop to him winning three in a row. Well, good luck, Tim. Starting second, this driver is very well known in the state of Pennsylvania and all over the country. John Keister started out the year last year winning ten thousand dollars. Had bad luck here at Motorama last year in time trials. Was not able to run on Sunday. You think you got what it takes to dethrone Sean Nye? You did qualify to 6.661. Uh, I think we're plenty capable. Uh, there's a lot of guys in this group here that are capable of winning. But uh, hey, we're having a little better luck this year. Hopefully we can pull it off. Anybody want to thank John? Uh, I got to thank everybody that helped me today. Uh, performance Manufacturing, <laughs> Slack High School Chassis, Josh Philpott. Hopefully we can win this. Well, good luck, John. Now for your pole sitter for the Pro Flathead, $500 to win. This driver also resides in New York. Ran a blistering lap at a 6.645, the 82 of Will Shields. Uh, I'd like to thank Speed Tech and Vermeer, Kevin Smith Racing Engines. VA Custom Hatters and uh, Snow's Garage. And uh, hopefully we can put this thing up front. So, you have one feature win today already. That was 20 laps. A pro race is 25. You gonna be able to hold on? Um, I don't know. <laughs> well, tuck her down, buddy, and good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, that is your field. 15 starters for Pro Flathead. Driver's crew, get them on the ground. Gentlemen, so 
do you think? Will John Keister come away with the pro win? Or will Shields lead wire to wire from the pole position? Or will Sean Nye do the unthinkable three in a row? Here at Motorama from the seventh spot. Excuse me, eighth spot. The time is now. Three and four on the hammer. Pro race is underway. going to come out. We're going to stack them up this time. Single file. A stack of up coming off a of corner number four. Green flag is out and we're back on the way. Will Shields, your current leader, John Keister, second. Tim Nye, third. Trying to work on Will Shields. Three of four, Schwartz looking underneath. Here comes Ross now trying to peek underneath Ryan Schwartz. Will Shields, still your leader. John Keeser sit by Ryan Schwartz. Will Shields gets out of shape there. Keeser's going to capitalize. John Keeser's going to take the lead. like the 16 of Eric Ritchie. Tire came off the bead. Easter leads Shields. Tim Nye, Ryan Schwartz, Kale Ross. As your top five, French Hall, Seaver, Nye, Sickles, Richfield, Madigan. John Keister gets up to a good start. Richfield trying to look under Sickles. Can't make the pass out. Nose to tail. On back to third. On back. Nose to tail. Second spot, tough break for the 82 of Will Shields. Right now, Jonathan Keister. Ryan Schwartz. Hale Ross, Sean Nye, Cody Seaver, Crenshaw, Critchfield, and Shields. home the money, and who is the 2013 Pro Race Champion. Green flag is out for John Keister. 
Ryan Schwartz now. Kael Ross, Sean Nye. Sean Nye is trying to work on Kael Ross. Is trying to look under the receiver for the fourth spot. For the fifth spot. As of right now, two sticks in the air for Jonathan Keister in the 12. This time he's going to see the white flag. Next time he's going to see the payday. The payday five and second flag through three and four. Jonathan Keister is going to be your 2013 Pro Flathead Champion. Good way to start the season for 2013. Yeah, uh, like I said before, I got to thank uh, Performance Manufacturing. Built this great chassis, both good on concrete, asphalt, dirt. Um, Nick, Jody, Tim, all the guys, Josh Philpot, uh, Liquid Speed Tire Prep. Um, I don't know, KKP. So. Well, great job, John. You got out to the lead, like I said. It was set sail from there. They had nothing for you, John. They even though they have cautions, you just pull away. Cart looked awesome. Definitely a way to start the 2000 season. So on behalf of Motorama, Shellheimer Speedway, JoeCarter.com, congratulations. You are the 2013 Pro Flathead Champion. Thank you. <laughs>